LCW Unfiltered Universe Mode Stream Episode 9 The Season 1 Finale Which is the pay-per-view LCW Lucha Bowl Before I go to the actual rundown of the cards I just need to go into Twitch quickly Now that's all done, I will run down this evening's car for you. Hello, whoever's just joined the stream, I hope you're okay. The first match of the evening will be Lince Dorado, the Golden Lynx, versus the Lodensian Luchador, the Giro, who will be making his debut. Looking forward to this one. The second match of the evening will be Dominic Mysterio versus Chavo Guerrero Jr. Again, another one I am looking forward to seeing. The third match of the evening will be a six-man battle royal, which is going to be the Lucha Bowl battle royal, and will be for the Lucha Bowl briefcase and here are the people in the battle royal tiger mask the great sasuke the fabulous one mr fabulous lucas jackson akira tozawa the one two three kids and hushin thunder liger this is the specialty match of the lcw Lucha Bowl pay-per-view. The six-man Lucha Bowl Battle Royal for the briefcase. Looking forward to it. The fourth match of the evening will be Rey Mysterio versus Kalisto. Looking forward to this one. The fifth match of the evening will be Shark Boy versus the Hurricane. Another match I am most looking forward to. The co-main event of the evening will be between the Red Saint versus the Blue Saint. Thanks once again Blue Boy 1985 for lending me these awesome luchadors. You're in for a treat Blue Boy 1985, don't you worry. That's why I've put them on as the co-main event. And then at last but not least... Your main event of the evening will be a false count anywhere match for the LCW Lucha King Championship and will be Humberto Carrillo versus the champion Little Guido. The last time these two faced off for the title, it ended in a double count out, which I didn't want, but it happens. So as a result, there is a loophole that if you, if there's a double count out, you are still the official number one contender. So that is definitely the case here. He didn't get pinned or submitted. So as a result, Humberto Carrillo is still the official number one contender. You will kill it, buddy. I know you will. Little Guido's definitely got his work cut out for him as the champion. So, without further ado, guys, let's start the pay-per-view. As always, feel free to come on the air and say hello. All the interaction is always welcome. Please participate if you can. If you can't, that is also fine. Please give my Twitch a follow, which is Bald Warrior 1987 You'll be able to catch this stream 
on demand as it will be added to my YouTube channel after which is WrestleBlogger1987. Hope everyone is alright wherever you are in the world during these tough times. What is up, LCW Lucha Bowl? It is I, Bald Warrior1987, bringing you the action tonight from Lucha Bowl. is coming to you live from... We are live from Barcelona in Spain. Welcome to LCW Lucha Bowl. Before we proceed, we need to turn off all the entrances to ensure a nice, smooth pay-per-view. Without further ado, guys, let's start the show. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Introducing first, on his way to the ring, from San Juan, Puerto Rico, the Golden Lynx, Lince Dorado. And introducing his opponents, on his way to the ring, making his debut from Leeds, England, Le Dendian Luchador Lugiro. Let's go down to the ring, guys, for your opening contest of Lucha Bowl Lince Dorado versus Lugiro. Enjoy. Referee wants a nice clean fight, a nice drop kick from Lince Dorado and follows it up with a nice kick to the small portion of the back of the Giro. Nice swinging face buster from Lince Dorado, the Golden Lynx. Nice slice bread from Legiro. Nice alley oop snake eyes from Legiro. Nice. Nightmare from Lince Dorado only gets a one count. Nice super kick from Legiro. Nice knee drop to the small portion of the back from Legiro. Spinning heel kick from Legiro. LCW is home to some of the greatest luchadors around the world. Nice Samoan drop from Legiro. He's currently on the offensive. Nice Saito suplex from Legiro. Clubbing blow from the Giro. Nice spinning heel kick from the Ledenzian Luchador Sensation, the Giro. Nice sunset flip power bomb from Dorado. Nice 
nice neck breaker from Litsay Dorado. Nice Boston Crab from the Golden Lynx Dorado. Nice counter move from Laguero. Nice chop from Laguero. Laguero hits the muscle buster on Dorado. One, two, only a two count, guys. One, two, three. And your winner in his debut in impressive fashion. Give it up, people, for the Gero. This was a great contest to kick off Lucha Bowl. Both guys performed very well. But the better man here was Legero. from Leeds, England. He is also a proud member of the HBW family. Laguero has gained a ton of momentum moving forward now. Great performance as well from Dorado, who looks strong in defeat. On to the next match, let's go. <coughs> the following contest is scheduled for one fall. Introducing first, on his way to the ring, from San Diego, California, son of Rey Mysterio. Give it up, people, for... Dominic Mysterio and introducing his opponents on his way to the ring from El Paso, Texas member of the legendary Guerrero wrestling dynasty give it up people for Chavo Guerrero Jr. Let's go down to the ring guys for your second match of the evening Dominic Mysterio versus Chavo Guerrero Jr. A lot of history here between these two. Enjoy. <laughs> Referee wants a nice clean fight. <laughs> nice Hurricane Runner from Chavo Guerrero Jr. He goes for the cover. One. Only a one count, guys. Nice drop kick from Charbo. Nice European uppercut from Charbo Guerrero Jr. Nice tilt of wheel backbreaker from Guerrero Jr. Sends 
Chava Guerrero into the uh, corner does dominate. Suplex into a neckbreaker from Dominic Mysterio. Dominic goes for the cover. One. It's only a one count, guys. Nice backbreaker submission hold from Chavo Guerrero Jr. Look at the talk on that one, guys. Nice sharp elbow strike and a nice arm drag from. Mysterio. Nice Hurricane Runner from Dominic Mysterio. Nice Judo throw from Dominic Mysterio. Nice drop kick to the legs from Dominic. Thank you to all the content creators for creating these characters. They are bloody accurate versions. Nice snap mare from Dominic and kicks Chavo in the small of the back. Goes for the cover. One. Just a one count, boys. Sends Dominic into the buckle. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Nice mounted punches from Charbo. Nice knife edge chop from Dominic. Sends Dominic into the corner. Jumping arm breaker from Chavo. Chavo hits the trifecta of suplexes known as the Free Amigos. He goes to the cover. One, two, just a two count guys, this match is very back and forth already. Suicida from Chavo. Listen to the LCW universe rallying on both these wrestlers. This is indeed awesome. Dominic sings. Chavo into the ring steps. Seven. Nice elbow drop to the outside from Chavo. Eight. Nine. Ten. Okay, Chavo Guerra Jr. wins via count outs. What a disappointing ending to a phenomenally entertaining match. <laughs> the 
this loss has not hurt Dominic by any stretch of the imagination. Hello, whoever's just joined the stream, I hope you're okay. Disappointing, guys. Very disappointing. How dare you win by a count out, Charvo? We are going to press on, though, because I can't be bothered to restart the match. On to the next match of the evening. Let's go. The third match of the evening is a Lucha Bowl Battle Royal with the winner of the Battle Royal winning the Lucha Bowl briefcase. Introducing the participants from London, England, Mr. Fabulous Lucas Jackson. Introducing the next entry from Morioka, Japan, the great Sasuke. Introducing the next entry from Yamaguchi, Japan, Tiger Mask. Introducing the next entry from... Kobe Japan, the Stamina Monster, Akira Tozawa. Introducing the next entry from Minneapolis, Minnesota, the one, two, three kids. And introducing the last entry from Tokyo, Japan. Give it up, people, for the legendary... Hushin Thunder Liger. Let's go down to the ring, guys, for this six man Lucha Bowl Battle Royal. For the Lucha Bowl briefcase. I hope it's saved it as that anyway. The winner of, and if not, the winner of this will get the briefcase anyway for their efforts. Enjoy, guys. This is going to be a very tough one to pull, guys. Nice knee strike from Tozawa to Mr. Fabulous. Nice snap suplex from Tozawa to Mr. Fabulous. Fabulous is trying to eliminate the Cesaro. Nice back suplex from Tiger Mask on the great Suzuko. Nice side Russian leg sweep from the 1 2 3 kid onto Kushin Thunder Liger. Step up in Seguri from Akira Tozawa on the fabulous one, Mr. Lucas Jackson. Tozawa trying to eliminate Mr. Fabulous. Tiger Mask trying to eliminate the great Sasuke. Nice edge chop from Tozawa to Mr. Fabulous. <laughs> to 
Kozawa is trying to eliminate Mr. Fabulous. eliminates Hushin from the Liger. Nice X Factor from the 1 2 3 Kid Sutazawa. Nice Michinoku driver from the 1 2 3 Kid Su, bit of rival Tazawa. got eliminated then, but right, hang on by a thread. Nice snap suplex on Akira Tozawa from Tiger Mask. Nice flurry of strikes on Mr. Fabulous from the Great Sasuke who, fun fact people, trains Taka Michinuku. Nice stiff kick to the head of Mr. Fabulous from the Great Sasuke. Nice alley-oop powerbomb from the Great Sasuke. season on the line like they wanted it to be. The winner will still get the briefcase after this eight years ended because they'll be rewarded on their efforts whoever wins this, even if it's not on the line. Tazawa with the trouble in paradise on Lucas Jackson. Tiger Mask trying to eliminate the great Sasuke. Tazawa eliminates the one, two, three kids. We are down to four now. Great Sasuke trying to eliminate Mr. Fabulous. Larry Oso on Tiger Mask from Mr. Fabulous. Nice underhook DDT on the great Sasuke from Mr. Fabulous. Tazawa trying to eliminate the great Sasuke. Edge chop from Tazara to the Great Sasuke. <laughs> Mr. Fabulous trying to eliminate Tiger Mask. Akira Tozawa is trying to eliminate the Great Sasuke. <laughs> nice 
Thomas heads his takedown on Tazawa from the Great Sasuke. Mr. Fabulous hits the life changer on Tiger Mask. The great Sasuke eliminates Akira Tozawa. We are now down to three. Fabulous trying to eliminate Tiger Mask and Mr. Fabulous eliminates Tiger Mask. We are now down to the final two the great Sasuke and Mr. Fabulous Lucas Jackson. Fabulous and calls it a nice jumping elbow drop. Is Mr. Fabulous going to win this? And your winner of the Lucha Bowl Battle Royal, Mr. Fabulous Lucas Jackson. As a result of this, he has won. The Lucha Bowl briefcase, which means this will give him a shot at the champion, whomever it may be, whenever he wants. Well done, Mr. Fabulous. I thought he was going to win anyway, so well played Mr. Fabulous, you've got a bright future here in LCW. On to the next match. The following contest is scheduled for one fall, introducing first on his way to the ring from San Diego, California, Rey Mysterio, and introducing his opponents on his way to the ring from Mexico City, Mexico, Carlisto. Let's go down to the ring, guys, for this match between Rey Mysterio versus Kalisto. Enjoy. <laughs> Referee wants a nice clean fight. Nice collar and elbow tie up from Rey Mysterio. Backs Kalisto into the corner. Referee calls for a clean break. Oh, Slariotto into the corner from Mysterio. with the 
three amigos on Kalisto. Hello, whoever's just joined the stream, I hope you're okay. Nice spinning heel kick from Kalisto. Nice head scissors takedown from Kalisto. He follows it up with a nice kick to the lumbar, a small portion of the back of Rey Mysterio. Nice hurricane runner from Kalisto. And another hurricane runner from Kalisto. Nice rolling snap neck breaker from Kalisto, shades of WWE, Hall of Famer and former Intercontinental Champion, Mr. Perfect Kurt Hennig. Nice power bomb from Rey Mysterio. taking a short hiatus after this pay-per-view. Nice kick to the body from Kalisto. Nice. Hurricane runner from Kalisto, but Rey Mysterio looks right back up. Nice. Which is his takedown from Rey Mysterio. Trifecta of Simplex is known as the Three Amigos. They tribute to his late friend and brother, Eddie Guerrero. Rey Mysterio hits the 619. Goes for the cover. One, two, just the two count, boys. This match is very competitive so far. Let's drop it to the legs from Rey Mysterio. Nice rolling snap neck breaker from Rey Mysterio. If Rey hits the frog splash, it is game over for Kelly Stowe. Same as a combination of suplexes known as the Free Amigos. A nice lip up from Kalisto. Nice 
Springbull, Harrison Ronas, from Wayne Mysterio, one, two, just a two count guys. Well, he went for a suplex, but how he's so count is it? He's kicked to the head from Kelly Stoke. And goes for the cover. One, two, three. And your winner, Kelly Stoke. What a win for Kalisto. Gaining a ton of momentum going forwards. Nice show of respect from these two Luchador sensations. On to the next match of the evening. Let's go. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Introducing first, on his way to the ring, from the deep blue sea, Shark Boy. And introducing his opponents, on his way to the ring, from Raleigh, North Carolina, the Hurricane. Let's go down to the ring, guys, for this match between Shark Boy versus the Hurricane. Enjoy. Referee wants a nice clean fight. Nice cross body from the Hurricane. Nice knife edge chop from the Hurricane. Nice, nice drop kick from the Hurricane as well. Shark Boy sees the Hurricane. He's the corner. the run here guys. He is a stone cold shark boy. Look at him picking apart the eyes of the hurricane. Nice punch from Stone Cold Shark Boy. Nice vertical suplex from Shark Boy. Give him a shell, yeah, people. Nice knee strike to the face from Shark Boy. Pulls it up with a nice snap suplex. Shades of the Dynamite Kid, Tom Billington. Great wrestler, but a crap human being. He was not a good influence on Baby Boy. Nightmare back into the ring from Shark Boy. Shark Boy knocks in the million dollar dream but was way too close to the ropes. Shark Boy goes for the pin. One. Just a one count, guys. Oh. 
Shark Boy with the million dollar drain on the Hurricane. The Hurricane counters it though. Nice knee strike to the face from the Hurricane. And holds that really nice knife edge chop. My sunset flip power bomb from the Hurricane. From the Hurricane. Nice drop kick from the Hurricane. Nice abdominal stretch from the Hurricane. Look at the tilt on that one, guys. Nice head scissors takedown from Shark Boy. Nice back elbow from the Hurricane. Hurricane hits the Vertibreaker on Shark Boy. He goes for the cover. One, two, just a two count, guys. The Hurricane is currently in control. A snap DDT on the apron from the Hurricane, the hardest part of the ring. And to listen to the LCW Universe rallying on both these wrestlers, this is indeed awesome guys. Hurricane with the eye of the hurricane. If he goes to the cover. One, two, only a two count. What does the hurricane have in mind now? Hurricane hits the hurry choke slam. On Shock Boy. He goes for cover. One, two, three. And your winner, the Hurricane. What a win for the Hurricane. Everyone that wins their matches will be added to the title rankings. Nice show of respect from these two. This was a very entertaining match. On to it's the co main event of the evening. Let's go. The following contest is your co-main event of the evening and is scheduled for one fall. Introducing first, on his way to the ring, from Jalisco, Mexico, the Red Saints. And introducing his opponents, on his way to the ring, From Gomez Palacio, Mexico, the Blue Saints. Let's go down to the ring, guys, for your co main event of the evening the Red Saint versus the Blue Saint. Enjoy. <laughs> Referee wants a nice clean fight. Nice side headlock from the Blue Saint. The Red Saint shoots him off the ropes. Nice drop kick from the Red Saint. 
big shout out to my man Blue Boy 1985 for lending me these awesome luchadors. That's how much I think of you, Blue Boy 1985. I have put them as the co-main event. Nice head scissors takedown from the Red Saint. Nice sharp elbow strikes to the crown of the head from the Red Saints. Nice snap suplex on the Blue Saint from the Red Saint. This kind of reminds me of Sub-Zero versus Scorpion from Mortal Kombat. Spanish fly from the Red Saint, but the Blue Saint nips right back up. Nice head scissors takedown from the Blue Saint. He goes for the cover. Not even a one count there, guys. LCW Lucha King Championship match to come. Humberto Carrillo will be taking on the champion Little Guido in a Force Count Anywhere match. Stun gun from the Red Saint. He goes for the cover. One. Just a one count, boys. Nice stun gun from the Red Saint. On the Blue Saint from the Red Saint. Red Saint goes to the cover. One, two, just the one count. Snap there from the Red Saint and follows it up with a nice drop kick to the small portion of the back. Nice Spanish fly from the Red Saint. These two wrestlers are on excursion from Blue Boy 1985's promotion, Ring of Valor. Nice head scissors takedown from the Blue Saint. Nice drop kick from the Red Saint. Nice Tiger Driver backbreaker from the Red Saint. He goes for the cover. One, two. Just a two count, guys. Snap suplex from the Red Saint. It's like an angle slam type move for Red Saint, this did. One. Two. It's a two count. 
Who will be the better saint here, guys? Will it be the red saint or the blue saint? Now, Sets is a takedown from the red saint, who is currently in control. Saito suplex from the red sign. What does he have in mind here, I wonder? Nice. Sent on bomb. From the red sign. One, two, three. And your winner, the red Saints. What a great co main event, guys. Both these guys fought valiantly. Well done once again to the Red Saint for picking up a big W here. You've gained a lot of momentum moving forward now, my friends. Great effort as well from the Blue Saint who looks strong in defeat. On to the main event of the evening, let's go. The following contest is your main event of the evening and is a Fools Count Anywhere match for the LCW Lucha King Championship. Introducing first on his way to the ring from Monterrey, Mexico, Humberto Carrillo. And introducing his opponents on his way to the ring from Little Italy. He is the reigning and defending LCW Lucha King Champion. Give it up people for Little Guido Maratato. Let's go down to the ring, guys, for this Falls Count Anywhere match for the LCW Lucha King Championship, Humberto Carrillo versus the champion, Little Guido. Enjoy. <laughs> Referee wants a clean fight. Waist lock from Filio, nice sleeper hold from the champion Little Guido. Nice knee to the lumbar from Little Guido. Nice body slam from Little Guido. Nice 
stun gun from Little Guido. Nice drop salt from Little Guido. He goes for the cover. One. Just leave one kill. The end of a double count out the last time these two face each other when the fight was on the line. And. Decided that Humberto Carrillo was still the official number one contender as he did not get pinned or submitted. That's the only loophole someone can stay the number one contender is if there was a double count out involved. And in that case, there was. Humberto goes for cover, not even a one count there, guys. Nice reverse DDT from. Humberto. Humberto with the jackhammer on Little Guido. Jumping DDT from Carrillo. A standing shooting star press from Carrillo. That's body slam from Little Guido Maritato, a member of the FBI. Goes for the cover. One. Just a one count, boys. <coughs> nice head butt to the midsection from Carrillo. Nice jackhammer to Little Guido from Carrillo. Nice Samoan driver from Carrillo. Jumping arm breaker from Carrillo. He pulls it up with a nice Fujiwara arm bar. <laughs> nice drop kick. This old drop kick from Carrillo. He goes for the cover. One. Two. Only two count. <laughs> he locks in the rings of Saturn, a reverse rings of Saturn. Barricades. 
and a spin in. Head scissors, see what's there from Mourinho. And things like that have been there, flesh. Nice roll up on the outside line. Two. Only two count. Nice mess. Slam from Mourinho. Nice roll up from Mourinho. One. Two. Only a two count. Sends Guido into the ring steps, that's Carilio. Yes, reverse DDC from little Guido, he goes to recover. One, two, just a two count. Locks in the cross, Harbaker, and puts the legs as well. Curry the eight taps. Here is your winner, and still, OCW Lucha King Champion, Little Guido Maratato. This was a very back and forth match, guys. was yeah very back and forth lots of back and forth spots between both these guys little guido pretty carillo why he is the alpha male of lcw by retaining his title Well done, Guido, for successfully retaining your championship. Yeah, guys, that was my LCW Unfiltered Universe mode stream. Episode 9. First season 1 finale, the pay-per-view. Lucha Bowl. Hope you enjoyed it guys, okay? Before I come off the air, I'd like to remind you of three things. Number one, when you're out and about, please keep wearing your masks. Two, keep social distancing as much as you can. And three, whenever you get home, please keep washing your hands. The more you keep listening to the government's advice, the the sooner we will be back to a normal life some point down the line. Don't be selfish guys, I know you can do this. The more you keep listening to the government's advice and following the rules, the more chance we will have of our liberties and rights coming back. Until my next stream guys, take care and stay safe. So long now. <laughs>